Well, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Man the Maker. Welcome back. This is Star Sector. Yeah, we know what game we're playing. Just a Pepsi Max with ice tonight. Respect to that, though. Respect to that. Um, we're going to bring it. Yeah, everybody's got slightly reduced combat readiness, but I think... I think it's good, yeah? Um, I want to bring you in. I like you. I'm going to leave you back. That seems good. And what I'm going to do, Sunder, Sunder, follow me. You follow him. Calm relays everywhere. And that's our defense point. Let's go. I we have we have oh I quite like the Thunders. They've got that ion cannon, which I do find to be appealing. Okay, don't come on. Be kind. Be ki people. 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 Jesus. Not the best drivers, I must say. All right, I'm out of here, folks. I've had enough of this crap. Yeah, 85. That's 85% CR. It's not great, but we don't have to worry about it really until uh, we reach our peak performance time, which is still a while away. Um, I'm actually going to say that's the defense point. We can ditch this out. This. Let's move over there. You know, much like the idea of kind of like being in the middle, potentially flanked on both sides. Probably having uh, one of our pilots, me, charge right up the middle and get completely surrounded and therefore annihilated. Now, why do I have the Sunders? Okay, Sunders? Jesus, why do I have them firing? Following me? I'm really good at taking down shields. There's some craft coming in. Just barely saw that guy. Really good at taking down a guy's shields. These things are really good at messing people up when the shields are down. And that's what I'm hoping they're gonna do. Okay, uh, no. I just wanted to look at that thing. I'm gonna go a little bit faster speed to start off. Did I? Keep backing it up. Yeah. Harbinger can do some scary things. Lots, yeah. All these missiles coming in. There's the Apogee, which is the big boy. Yep, there goes. Our people just charging right on ahead. I kind of want this Apogee. Gotta be careful about getting flanked over here. Okay, you're firing locusts off. It's fine. Looks like we have made an engagement here. I mean, if this is what you want, buddy. If this is what you guys want, this is what we can do. Sunders. Yeah. This is not a, a trade that you're going to win, my friend. Okay, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. How you guys doing up here? Nice. We've drawn a nice battle line. I mean, we can crush that northern side as long as I keep this Apogee distracted. I will feel quite happy. Just 
which I'm quite keen to do. Yeah. That's what I kind of thought, buddy. That's what I kind of thought. Um, I want you... to go after that. And you and you to go after this thing. I'm gonna go. I'm a little nervous. You... Don't be right in front of me, dude! You have so many places to go. And you have chosen here. So many different places for you to move to, and this is, this is of course, where you've chosen to go right in front of me. Yeah. Oh. Not too crazy about that, are ya? Alright. Don't get in front of me. Oh, he's taking so much damage. Yep, that's it. You're done. Harbinger's been disabled. Apogee's disabled. I think we can kill this. We've taken out the scary parts of their fleets. You've done your job. I think we can now turn around. Very, very slowly turn around. And start moving over this direction. Say hi. Did you have shields? I didn't quite see them. Yeah, now you're fluxed. Now we can put the screws on you. You're down. Gotta be careful, there's some more missiles and stuff. Um, oh yeah, this is over though. Uh, Windborn, sorry a bit late today. It's your son's birthday and you thought the stream was Sunday to boot. Isn't isn't today Sunday? Today is Sunday. Today is Sunday. Yes, okay, you also have re recognized that. <laughs> yeah, man, it's in quarantines, you know? It doesn't, uh, it's Blortvig day. As uh, my wife sometimes calls it, or I sometimes call it. Yeah, it is Sunday. Happy birthday to your son. I will say that. Oh yeah, hammered lowered combat readiness. Yeah, we'll just fire our guns at whoever is here. This is gonna be an opening. Watch watch the maneuver. Watch the maneuver. Burn drive. It's perfect. It's not perfect. <laughs> So much damage from this. Watch. It's going to be eh, not so bad, actually. Oh. He's somewhat protected by my bad aim, mostly. Ah, oh, there you go. Let's go. We're charging in. We're going to rely on our PD to protect us from these missiles and such. Yeah, that's one way to do things. I mean, I'm just gonna tell everyone, be be super, oh, don't retreat, be super aggro. It's Monday somewhere in the world. Yeah, maybe uh, Duran, is it is it Monday? It is Monday for Duran, if he's still here. Got a bunch of bombers coming in, but I'm not gonna sweat it. Most of them have just been absorbed.
Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna boost in here as well. I've had enough. Y'all are not. Oh, this is actually dangerous. Uh, yeah. And I'm flexed out. Oh, saved! Saved, saved, saved by that hulk of a flying spaceship. Please? How long is the damn flux? How long is the damn flux? My god, sometimes. I tell ya. Why are you guys not being as aggressive as I want you to? You can just retreat, probably. I want you to go after this guy. Uh, you have actually... Oh, your hull is fine. Gonna take out... Yeah, that's a lot. You're my target. Come on. Actually, haven't fired any of these things yet. Yeah, you're flexed out. I'll fire one. Hammerhead has got critical malfunctions. Yeah, you can just retreat, buddy. Burn drive, say hi. Yep, that's one way to do it. The enemy fleet is defeated, but I would really like... That should do it for you. Um, we lost the Falcon. Huh. Didn't see that coming. If you guys wonder if you missed on the VOD or on YouTube, probably should throw some likes in this series over there anyways. Hey, always appreciated. Um, Hunter Fleet, you've left some stuff. Yeah, pursue second in command. Wow. Very low combat readiness. Yeah, you guys can all go. End the venture. Try and track down as much as you can. Um, yeah, there's our Falcon, but this time it's even more busted up, and I think that's the- I think it's had enough. Sorry, buddy. You're- you're too messed up for me. You also. I will just pick through the wreckage. Take everything. We have way too much stuff. We can just get rid of the metal. Still have too much stuff. Um... No, that's actually sells for a pretty nice penny. Uh, maybe some junk weapons. How much do you weigh? Two. Antimatter blaster, I like. Heavy neither, for sure we like. Just trying to get rid of a couple of things. I mean, I guess they do sell technically for more than some other stuff. I mean, you do. Not that I ever sell this stuff. Um... Yeah, whatever. Take that. Did I? Yes. Ooh, well, a bunch of times since we last saved. It's lovely that the hegemony is paying us money to do this. It's really, really quite nice. Um, we're going to Jangala. That is correct. There's the prison freeport. We do have money. You got anything cool? Fuel? At not the greatest price, but... I mean, I will buy fuel because I like to use it. That's not a good price. Jangala wants domestic goods. I'll take you some domestic goods. Right? Jangala wants these. I'll take these. 
They did this last time and they weren't super crazy. Yeah, yeah. Also this. The terrible price. Two ninety four and it's in demand. It just doesn't really make sense. Um, Jangala, you want more domestic goods? We have more than enough. And the food is probably not worth it. High intensity lasers, I will buy some of you. This place has got some cool stuff usually. Can't get the high end seller because the independents hate us. Does make sense. I have not exactly been the nicest. Apogee's are pretty cool. Hmm. I don't want to spend all my money on it though. I think I'm quite happy. Like the fleet we have right now, I feel confident in it. Now, Okay, I say that if we get attacked by another, like, seven conquest fleet, we're going to be in trouble. I could engage the Star Fortress. <laughs> and then launch a raid against it. Wow, that's crazy. Star Fortress times three. That would bring it down a lot. I mean... Acquiring blueprints. Oof. That would be nice. I don't think we're going to do it, though. Um, maybe also what we should consider. Maybe we try and make friends with, with, the, uh, with the independents. I'm fine with that. Like, if anyone should be our friend, it should be the independents. Tritachion as well, because they are relatively amoral. Here's Sindria. We're not going to mess with that. Um, yeah, okay. We just have to go into the clouds here. Uh, we are over cargo capacity. Let's make sure. Let's let's see what's going on. Domestic goods to Sindria. Wow. 200,000 for them. 2,000 units. It's not bad. Nothing else. I mean, any trade? Nope. Just this. Not that we could even get there if we wanted to. So. I do hate you. I do hate you. Let's pop into Garnier and then we'll go and try and make it to Jangala. We'll see. Order jump. Get the transponder off. Um, you are. You do. Okay. Hegemony, supplies, that's a really good price. I mean, I'll accept it and just maybe not do it. How about that? Um, Sindrian Dictat Expedition, targeting Tartesis in 55 days. We'll repair our ships. We can buy enough. We should absolutely do it. Jangala, you want... Yeah, it's not a great price, though. Only 600. It's really not worth buying. 149 for these. We can buy them at 50. It's easy money. The universe still wants me dead. We're, we're trying to, like... We're kind of trying to, to make friends with people. You still want some food... You still want a lot of domestic goods. Still really. 100 units at a lower price. Not bad. Jangala, you want them for a terrible price. Jangala, not interested in this. All right, I think we're just going to go pop on over to Jangala. We are way over the limit. Way over the limit. Um, let's just... Nope, we can definitely... Whoa, okay. That we should buy everything of. We don't have enough money. How can I make... I mean... It's a little bit of cash. I need to just make money now. Do you want this in Jangala? Yes, you do. Jangala, yes you do. Yes you do. Yes, yes you do. 
I mean, the food we could sell for 15 here or 18 in Jangala. I'd rather just sell that and buy as much of this as I can. Damn it. <laughs> There we go. Jangala, here we come. Let's hope that we can actually freaking land there, right? This is always this is always the situation. Can we actually land in Jangala? Will they allow us? Now, one thing we can do. Here yeah, we're over cargo capacity, that's fine. Uh heavy armor bits? I don't have a thousand units. Um no, this. 22 units. Uh, yeah, I will definitely accept that. I'm going to pick this up. I'm just going to take it and maybe draw out. I take control of the relay. Um, it's an act of war. I don't know. Let's just see if we can go ahead and land. Everyone's going to be pretty annoying about this. They're going to harass me. Oh, crap. Oh, what? <laughs> I didn't see that one coming. I did not see that one coming. Okay. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. This is going to go quite bad for us, I suspect. Quite bad for us. Um, and we just sunk all of our money into the possibility of bringing stuff here to sell. And of course, we run into this fleet. Of course we do. But that's going to be next time when we will fight for our goddamn lives. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. My name is Man the Maker. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful day.